Hi. Hi. Hello. Hi. Breadloaf. Sure. Hi. Hello. How's it going? Today, I am hoping to maybe finish the game today. Because... Because I am leaving for vacation on Thursday. So, and I kind of want to finish this game before I leave. So, yeah. I want, because I, 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 yeah, I really want to finish this game before I leave. Uh, Chunk, oh, I need your help with a matter of grave Yeah, I'm, I'm feeling better see, for now. Thanks for asking. have been off the charts today, and I fear something terrible is happening just off the coast. Chandler and I are headed to Simmering Springs to investigate, and I'd be greatly reassured if you could join us. Uh, I'm going, I'm, go I'm going to be going back home, oh, back home to Malaysia for the rest of the summer. So, yay. Yay. A British character. <laughs> yay. That, that yeah, you know. That that's going this is going to be how I feel when I when I get back home on fire. <laughs> that's how I'm, that, that's going to be me e one, one, once I get back home. <laughs> I remember the last time I went back, I went back home. I, I just felt the, the I felt I I literally felt the heat the moment I stepped out of the plane. So that yeah, that was fun. <laughs> I I felt the heat blasting at me the moment I stepped out of the plane. All right, anyways, let's go. Uh, someone wanted, someone had a, a side quest for me. It was Triffany. I remember it was Triffany. Someone has had a quest. Hey. Apparently. Hello. Denmark in four days. Nice. Where's Triffany? Where'd Triffany go? What the heck? Oh, there she is. Oh, I suppose we're going so. exploring. There's only one more place mentioned in Grandma's journal. All right then, let's go. We've got a head for. Why does the chat look so weird? Uh, yeah, for some... Okay, yeah, that, that's weird. It, it did not uh, like your apostrophe, apparently. Let me reset the chat. Almost Let me try to reset... To Grandma blog. Grandma writes Let me try resetting the chat real quick. Means we ought to start climbing, don't you think? Let me try resetting the chat. Hold on. Uh, climb the mountain, okay. Okay, the chat has been reset, so I don't know. If, so we'll see. Oh, Scoopy Banoopy. Hello, Scoopy Banoopy. Do you have any other side quests? No, I've done every single side quest. Cool. Yay. Climb well, the mountain. I've done that before. I have gotten all the, the, the snacks in this in this area, right? Yeah, I've pretty much got captured almost pretty much all the the bug snacks in the game, so I shouldn't have to worry about catching in anymore. Does it work? Okay, yeah, then that's probably Streamlabs being weird. I mean, that seems like like that seems like I I, I mean that that seems seems just like I mean that's I'm not surprised by stream Streamlabs is al is always weird. It's always kind of weird, champ. I want to get to the top of the mountain. Is this not the top of the mountain? Climb the mountain. Yeah, I'm climbing the mountain. Hi. Oh, is she is she following us? Oh, okay. I guess let's keep climbing. We're following. Is she following us? Where'd she go? Oh, she went this way. All right, this is the this is as far up as we can go. What you looking this for? This is it, all right. This camp had to be one of Grandma's, and Yay. I'm thinking that could be her right there. 
It'd be a fitting way oh boy to <laughs> staring out over the land she loved exploring and what's oh, hi this grandma snack? maybe a last meal or wait what's wrong even when i was a kid grandma didn't have too many teeth this can't be her unless ugh, unless i'm remembering wrong or she got spares it's uh they were getting I a bit too, too close say. right here if i want to be dead sure Mm, nice. Yes. Th thanks. <laughs> okay. Thanks. He sold the corpse on eBay. Sure. How much? Oh, oh, that was it. You just wanted to climb the mountain. That was it. <laughs> you, that, that, is that all we had to do? Okay then. How much do you think a corpse is worth anyway? All right, back to Snacksburg. That was all we had to do. So, so yay. Is that it? Anything, anything else, else, Triffany? Uh, Chum, I need your. You see, uh, Chum yeah, yeah. and I are headed to Simmering. Yeah, sure. We're, we're, we'll do that. Bunger's getting out of the barn. Oh, Bunger's. Oh, oh. <laughs> like what's going on there? Bunger's getting out of the barn. What? Oh, let's restock on sauce. Oh, I really need chocolate. Aloha. Are we done with Triffany? How's it hanging? Hi. I need to restock on these, uh, on the sauce. Where's Triffany? Are we done with Triffany? Yeah, I think I think so. I'm sorry to say, Professor Lotterblog, but you and this charming specimen are not related. Oh, well, that's all right then. Thanks for the help. Two point six seven yen. I could sure. use a few Yay. more skeletons in my closet. <laughs> Go ahead. It doesn't really matter now, anyway. All right then. Oh, you have more. Hold on, let me go grab some more. Uh... Well, that so that's not grandma. That that corpse is not grandma. So I guess you can still. I guess, I guess you can sell it if you want. You okay? I'm not doing too good. I'll never know what happened to my grandma. The end of Bronica Lotta Blog is a big blank spot in history. There's nothing left of her here. <laughs> Just like everybody else who came to this island. A place where you go to be forgotten. A place where I'll be forgotten. But, you know, maybe at least the Buck Snacks will remember me. Yay. Sidetracked. No, that means I got the achievement sidetracked. That must mean I've completed every single side quest. And I got the skeleton as a decoration. Oh boy. I got, I got a corpse as a decoration. Go put it right here. Yeah. Hell yeah. Nice. Perfect. Let's go to sleep. <clears throat> Let's go get it, uh, and then let's go help Hello, out. Uh, well? Let's go uh, deal with uh, Snorpy. Uh, yeah, yes, yeah, 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 sure, let's go. <laughs> Splendid. Meet us there whenever you get the chance. In the meantime, we have preparations to make. Sure. And lo, ready the sunscreen. <laughs> Meet Snorpy in Simmering Springs. Oh, okay. I guess, I guess we're going there ourselves. Hello. Sir. To Sibbing Springs! Have you ever heard of Raid Shadow Legends? You mean the online... I, I forget how, how the ad goes. I, I, I forget how the ad, the ad goes. <laughs> but you can click the link in the description to, to get this many coins or something. Simmering Springs.
BTS channel point reward. I'm... I don't know. I, I think I can do that. I need to need a separate extension for that. But maybe. At the same time, I don't want people saying not not nice things on in, in TTS. So, yeah. All right, what's going on? Oh, yeah. I always wanted to have a beach party. Need me to sunscreen your back, Snorf Dog? <laughs> no, no, no need, Chandlo. I'm well protected. I can tolerate the horrible sun for at least a few minutes. You sure? I could check if you missed a spot. <laughs> Best to keep our wits. Whoa. Us. This seismic getting, event getting spicy anyway. right there. Oh, oh, oh. Bro, this what is fine. Was that? They're not usually this intense. An anomaly, to be sure, but it ended An anomaly? Oh, we gotta fix it. Oh, oh. We gotta report the anomaly so it can be fixed. Report anomaly. It's a new island, dog! We gotta go over there! <laughs> Must we? Uh, um, yes, uh, of course. Uh, but surely this job is bigger than the three of us. We need to form a miniature expedition. A gathering of our finest scientific minds. Of course, that means Triffany and... Floofty. Ooh, get Shelda, too. Shelda? Well, she's hardly qualified. You said you want the finest minds, and Shelda's loaded with wisdom. Bam! Team assembled. Oh, I suppose she is an herbalist, and the closest thing we have to a doctor without Eggabel around. Very well. Tell Triffany, Floofty, and Shelda to come to the beach. Chandler and I will stay here to prepare a way across. Get okay. Hyped. As Triffany, Floofty, and Shelda. Sure, I guess. There. I. I also. I'm also hydrated. So where is hey, hey. There's Triffany? There's Triffany. Do it. You wanna join the expedition? You believe I do. Islands don't just pop into me and yeah. every day, you know. Of course. I got no business left here, so I'll go on ahead and meet you on the beach. Okay. Next we're gonna ask Floofty. Oh, hello. A joint expedition? So an unknown piece of geography has erupted from the ocean, unexplained and unstable, likely to sink again at any moment. Yes. So of course I'm going. I will gather my equipment. Okay. And Shelda. Hold on before we ask Shelda. Uh do we get a new video diary? I don't remember. Today is the day I, Elizabeth Megapig. Is this new? I don't remember if we've watched this. I think I have watched this. I've been practicing. I... Yeah, I think I've watched that one already. Okay, let her fly and I'll show you. Uh, yeah, I've watched these already. All right, let's go ask Shelda then. Let's go to Shelda. You want to join the expedition? You're asking me? <clears throat> well, of course. Your need for guidance is great. Despite the peril, one will show you the path. And that scary little island. <laughs> if it's what I think it is, there's something there I need to see. All right, then. Cool. Let's go. Let's go. Yay. Oh, we got a boat. We already have a boat and a dock. 
That was quick. You guys built a boat and a dock. Everyone's ready. Ah, so soon. We're not quite ready yet. We could use another few days of assessment. What are you talking about, Snorp Dog? We got the raft ready in record time. Yeah, they, they got the raft ready in like a few minutes. Of course, Chandler. All right, yay. All righty. I'm here and ready to explore. Ooh, nice work on that raft there, Chandler. Thanks, Brophany. Indeed. If it is not <laughs> more than a finely crafted tomb for the foolish wanderers. Of course, Snorpington can get volunteers. Ah, oh, but it seems a vagrant has wandered into our expedition. Snacksburg is that way, Shelda. <gasps> Be still, your wicked tongue. One must show respect to one's elders. <laughs> I will respect you as soon as you do something respectable. Ooh. Oh, you think so highly of yourself that you alone are they who can know the unknowable? No, you bring ruin to all that you touch. Ruin to Egabel, ruin to Elizabeth, ruin to your own flesh and blood. I'm starting to think this might not have been the best idea. You know, six folks is a lot for one raft. Maybe one Ru of us Ruin. I, I cannot one? roll my tongue like that. Uh... We're all going. Me and Snorpy can hold it together. Actually, Chandler, uh, well, I was thinking you and I should stay here and supervise. What? Bro. Why'd I build all this stuff if we're not going? Don't you want to know what's on the new island? Well, I, I, of course I do, but look at that thing. That island is a death trap. I mean, probably. Come on, Snorp Dog. It's probably fine. I mean, it probably is a death trap. I gotta trap. go out there. They need me. Yes, somebody needs to caddy the septuagenarian. Shut it. You can go if you must, Chandler. But I'm staying here. But bro, we do bro. everything together. Bro. What if something happens to you while I'm gone? Me? Well, I'll be on this lovely beach. What if something happens to you? Yes, yes. You can both be struck by a meteor at any moment. Honestly, they do this every time Chen Lo goes to check the mail. <laughs> we stop wasting time and get on with this expedition before I'm as old as Shelda? <clears throat> you two are like mirrors, reflecting endlessly. One must look away from the infinite abyss and gaze down only at oneself. What? Oh. Far be it for oh. me to give anyone life advice, but there's nothing wrong with a little time apart. It's healthy, even. All right. If you all say so. Don't worry. I'll be in radio contact the entire time. And I've got trackers on at least three of you. Right. <laughs> Okay. okay. Yeah. Then All right then. <laughs> Noises of disparate I'll enthusiasm. Just jump on the raft when you're ready. All right, let's go. This is the mysterious. And this is the DLC. I know this is the DLC side quest. This this is the DLC quest line. So yeah. Let's go! Yay! Broken tooth. All right, Snorp Dog. We made it to the other island. We found some kind of reef cove thing to land on. Chandler, listen to me. It's very important. You need to understand that remote detonator. The what? Something about remote Stop detonator? It. Oh, Grump, the radio's broken. No, no. I think we're just out of range. Or there could be some interference going on. Probably oh, interference. Fortunate. I suppose we will have to proceed without Snorpington's so-called supervision. But maybe we should go back and tell him? It'll only take an hour. The threshold is crossed. It cannot be uncrossed. I mean, it could. If you think I'm spending another minute on that plank of wood today, <laughs> you are dead wrong. <laughs> yeah, you're always right, Shelda. Snorpy knows we got this. He'd want us to keep exploring. Huh. Looks like there's a way across up there. 
Let's check it out, bro. <laughs> Alright, bro. Let's go, bro. This way. This is like some kind of reef. Do we need to light that thing up? I bet Snorpy's trip shot could do it. Alright. Nice! Last one across is a rotten angler! Yay. Light the way. The way has been lit. It's lit! It's lit. Yay. Yeah, let's go. Well, would you look at that? Some kind of ancient maze carving. With moving parts and everything. Well, whoever built it put it directly in our way. Chenlo, you excel in brute force. Destroy this. You got it, floof dog. Uh, if you sure that's a good idea. Talk again and see what happens. <laughs> now hold on, hold floof on. Floof dog. Let's not go smashing the priceless antiques just yet. Looks like you could fit your buggy ball down there in the entrance. I bet if we solve this maze, something real interesting is gonna happen. Good idea. Go. Go, uh, Sprout. Go, Sprout. Go, Sprout. Yay. Goodness, that mechanism still works. Good job, Sprout. <laughs> this time, not to mention the water damage. If that's just the door, who knows what historical goodies we'll find inside there. All right, then. Good job, Sprout. What else we got here? That is a big, some big bug snacks. Big bunger. Whoa! It's a jungle out there! Oh, goodness. To think that this whole valley was underwater not that long ago. I can even see evidence of civilization from who knows when. Oh, check out that impressive looking temple up there. One is more concerned with the ominous crater that lies beneath. If my eyes do not deceive me, I believe I've spotted new varieties of bug snacks as well. New yes. bug snacks? Sick! Think they could be dangerous? Probably. That's an easy way to find out. Well, uh, before we get too ahead of ourselves, we might want to set up a base camp. A wonderful idea. Good idea. <laughs> One could use time to uh, recenter. Five minutes in, and you already need a nap. Leave the labor to the protective members of society, then. Oh, please don't start this again. Bros! Come check Bro. this out! You seeing what I'm seeing? It's bunger time! That is a big bunger. Excellent. Why don't you go and fetch it for us, Chenlo? Way ahead of you, dog! That is a big bunger. Oh dear. You better go follow and help him out. We'll stay up here and start setting up camp. Bunger. Big bunger. Catch one bunger royale. It's a bunger, but big. It's always a bigger bunger. It's a bunger, but big. So is it like it likes salt? It likes ketchup and cheese. Wait, is it just me, or is that bunger way uh -uh. bigger than normal? Look out, bro! bro! Oh, he's dead. Now, how do we catch this big bunger? I'm assuming it's too big for our crap. Yeah, way too big for the trap. Bunger! Oh, jeez. Bunger. Bunger, bunger. You okay, Chanlo? Ow! No, he's dead. My muscles and my bones. Yeah, I think he's dead. Where am I? I hit some kind of statue room. Looks like she's holding a thing. I don't know what that is. 
But try throwing it at the big bunger. Maybe that'll do something. Interesting. Oh god. It's gonna blow. Oh, it became too small. Stop being big! I bet it's small enough to catch now! It, 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 it shrank. Now I forget how you, uh... No. We're gonna need... Bunger! Don't we need another bunger? Do we need an, in, in, use another bunger to catch it? Unless, oh, the trap. Right. The trip shot. Oh, wait, we can use the trap. Yay, we got a bunger royale. Bunger. Bunger. Right, <laughs> you got bunger? I got hunger. Now bunger me, bro! Alright then, have the bunger. I have so much cake, I should have... I should have gotten rid of some... I should have cleared uh, some of my inventory. Bunger but have now. this... have a bunger. Where do you want the bunger? On your nose? Yeah, yeah bunger nose! So good! That's a whole meal in one bite! We gotta tell the others about this! Plus, I should probably help unpack. Yeah. Did you all see that? Giant bug snacks! Even the bungers out here are as big as Mama Melon! Gosh, we might be witnessing a prehistoric species somehow preserved at the bottom of the ocean! Aha! Uh -huh. That would align with my theory on the correlation between age and size. The lost sister of Snacktooth lies unburied. Yet you marvel at the engorgement of the toxins that dance on her grave. The lost what, now? Tell me, Chenlo, how did you come to capture this specimen? We found a jar of some kind of small dust. It came out of this old lady statue thing. A statue, eh? What did it look like? Like a big friendly grumpus lady with flowers all around her. Uh. No. That sounds like it could be a shrine to Mother Nature. Whoa. Shelda, that's your thing. No, 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 no. Ah, uh, but why would Mother Nature, no to despise her of bug snacks, be dispensing bug snack catching equipment? Hmm? Mm. Shelda, your god is a hypocrite. Silence, you wretch. The mother guides, the mother protects. If you so doubt, then one will wield the light of truth against your blasphemy. Okay. Okay, then. I guess Shelda's gonna go check out those shrines. Uh, meanwhile, I gotta go take a look at all the ruins around here. There's so much ancient history to uncover. I'm giddy just thinking about it. I am fascinated by this shrink spice and its effects on snack matter. If I can determine exactly what it's made of, I'm certain we will have much use for it. All right, bros. I know I'm not a scientist, but I got a hypothesis. If this island can make Big Bunger, can it make Big Chandlo? That's not what a hypothesis is. Honestly, what does my brother see in you? <laughs> oh, hush. I'm sure it's worth a try. Well then, let's get to it. All right then. <laughs> Oh, everyone investigate. Yay! Star Tiffany, I guess. Oh, thank goodness you're here. I'd say it's high time we get to exploring. I see another maze blocking the way deeper into the jungle. I bet if we solve it, we'll find something real exciting. All I'll right, go then. ahead and make my way over to the maze. Meet me there when you're ready for some puzzling. All right, then. Meet Triffany by the maze door. Lufty? 
This shrinking spice intrigues me. What substance could produce such a pronounced effect on bug snacks? From what I observed, it was manufactured by ancient rumpuses, so surely it'll be simple to recreate. Maybe. Oh, Seems. please. Bring an ancient rumpus to the present and they'd be utterly lost. Anything they can do, I can do fundamentally better. Frivolities aside, I require a sample of shrink spice for study. Bring a specimen here and place it into my trough. <laughs> All right, then. Outer keg. <laughs> Chandlo? Bro, I gotta see if eating these big bug snacks will make me big Chandlo. So you just I saw ate this one. huge snack lifting stuff near the river. Big lifting? You know I gotta get me some of that. <laughs> All right, catch one, clobs the Roni. One must see what lies within those supposed shrines to Mother Nature. Not shrines destroyed and forgotten, but one untouched by the ravages of time. One can see it up along the river's path. That is the place we must meet. However, the shrine is beyond one's reach. Yet again, you must remove an obstacle that shrouds the path. <laughs> All right, then. Cool. Let's go grab some of this uh, powder. See, the powder doesn't last long, seems like. All right, I technically brought the powder. Yeah, it, it, it kind of broke, but sure. It seems this substance becomes quite volatile when removed from its origin. A flaw in its design, perhaps. How troublesome. I may need to employ a more direct method of study. By which I mean, bring another sample here and throw it at me before it combusts. All right, then. Uh, isn't that dangerous? I am wearing goggles, aren't I? <laughs> All right, good, fair enough. Since the spice good enough. causes no apparent harm to bug snacks, I am reasonably certain that I will be fine. All right, then, if you say so. If you say so. Let's actually light that torch. Let's go light this torch, because I want to. Now let's light the next torch, which is well. Let's just keep lighting the torches. I'm sure they'll... They'll be useful. All right, let's grab another one. Ah, the goggles, they do nothing. <laughs> 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 Experience that I have learned two very important facts. One, the substance does not work on grumpuses. Two, I should not do that again. Good to know. I am no closer to obtaining a usable sample of shrink spice. However, I believe we may learn something from the local bug snacks. Use the shrink spice to capture one cheddar and one milimochi, then transform me with those specimens. All right, then. Sure. Hand into a cheddar, leg into a milimochi. <laughs> Roger that. That's a uh, Takata Masala. Breakable walls. Spaghider. Are we need to move forward by. You can break the walls. Hmm. Seems like this is as far. Hey, Bunger! Let's get Bunger to break the wall. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 
Oh god. Didn't work. It didn't work. Hmm. Well, there are some holes here. Let's try using Sprout. Oh, that worked. Oh god. Ah! Chet Orb. Chet Orb. Okay, I guess I'm out here now. It's a Milimochi. I need. I do need a Chet Orb and a Milimochi. So yeah. Oh god! Stop being on fire! Stop it! The fire will probably be useful against that Milimochi to unfreeze it. There's Ched Orb. I think I'm gonna need more of that shrink, the shrink spice. Giant Eggler shell. Interesting. This Clobsteroni. I'm gonna need uh I am gonna need uh eat more shrink spice though. Seem to be I seem to have run out at this shrine. Cheese. Is there any more? Any more shrink spice? There's more. Might need to reset the area though. I, I might need to let reset the the area. Now, now they're now they're tiny. Yeah, perfect. All right, we have mil we have some milimochi now. I'm gonna need more shrink spice though. We'll deal with that later. Oh, oh, this one is. Um, yeah, there's more here. Kinda nice to be away Reach from the others for a minute. The arguing can be uh, distracting. It has respawned. Trouble you know? with. I'm guessing Shelda, Shelda and Floofty. Oh well, I think Shelda's got a lot to teach us. It's just exhausting to get a real answer out of her. Then she can be a uh, tad judgmental. Just a tad. Gosh, I don't know. I feel like I ought to be taking more of a leadership role out here. But I do all my best work when I'm alone. <laughs> I'm but why alone. talk about all that unpleasantness when we could be neck deep in some dusty corpses? <laughs> the maze is right there. Indeed it is. You gotta use Sprout again, I'm guessing. Okay, let's try to catch the Ched Orb. First, let's light these torches. That'll probably be helpful. All right, Ched Orb is coming back. Let's grab a. Let's, let's grab some of this. It's now it's small. 
Let's use the trip short the trip shot. Is it not gonna the trap not work? Apparently the trap doesn't work. Doesn't doesn't work on Shed Orb. He's just hiding now. Shed Orb. Is he stuck? I feel like he's stuck. Let me try some. Let's tr let's just try bringing in the stem. I, he looks seems like he's stuck. That works. Get orb. All right, now we can feed the Ched orbs to uh, Ched orb and Millie Mochi to Flufty. Let's keep going. So Chocolant. Supposed to open air. It likes to play a keep away fellow chocolates. Okay, I see. Likes chocolate. Oh, I know. I have an idea. Shabby. Oh. Go. Seems like I might have to like, avoid the chocolate for now. I don't think I can catch the chocolate yet. Yeah, I probably just have to avoid it for now. There we go. Where'd the chocolate ant go? Chocolate ant disappeared. Uh, maybe we'll. Maybe we'll find another one. First of all, let's light the cave. Nope. Oh, no, no, no. I don't want to feed you anything right now. I completed the maze. We hit the archaeological jackpot! Woo! Woo! <laughs> Let's go inside, scan around, and see just what kind of ruin this is. <laughs> All right, first though, let's let's head back and 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 get and give Floofy these these things. Lobsteroni. Is there more? There is more. Cool. Just gonna take this for the Lobsteroni. No, it's just boing boing. It has a launch pad. It, it, it didn't work because of the... That works. I have, I have to time it. I have to wait for the time. It likes hot sauce and cheese. He's not moving. Interestingly. Let's try the cheese. Uh, 
Um, you okay? You okay there? Okay, then he just. That was weird. He just despawned. Boing, boing. Ah. He just despawned right there. That was weird. Okay. Let's try again. Unfortunately, he only stays in the water. There we go. I think that... that... I feel like Klopsteroni's AI is a bit broken. Yeah, I think he's a bit broken. Klopsteroni seems to be a bit broken. His AI seems to be a bit broken right there. Boing. I am boing boing. Sends a ramp, how nice. Does that open the door? Nice. Still not sure how, how to get uh Clobsteroni. How to catch his Clobsteroni though. I feel like he's he his he's a bit bugged. Breakable wall here. Not quite. There is some spice in there, though. Spice must flow. Okay, that does attract him. Maybe I have to get him out of the water. Excuse me? Oh wait, it's just, if it's just, uh, the spice, I should be able to just grab it, right? Should I? Maybe. Get orb, get orb. Get orb. Yeah, I can just grab it. This way, chat orb. Sorry, this way, uh, Closteroni. Oh, come on. Why are you so slow? This way! This way! What are you stuck on? All right then. There we go. That works. Globsteroni. Globsteroni. That works. All right, let's, let's head back to the camp and feed everyone. Alright, what did you want? Uh, what what did you want, Shelda? Uh, Shelda wanted... 
shall uh, destroy the obstacle. Okay. Walk in the light. Let's drop the Our obstacle. Past once more revealed, and yet no less treacherous. One's heart is filled with dread for the truths yet unknown within the river shrine. Nevertheless, we must push forward. <laughs> All right then. And you won the Bobsteroni, right? Clubs. You have have a that. <laughs> oh yeah! I can feel the lifting energy inside me, but I didn't get bigger at all. I guess I didn't get huge eating that big bunger either. You know what, bro? I'm just gonna admit to myself that it's not gonna work and move on. All right. I guess that means my investigation's over already. What do I do now? Challenge all the bug snacks to fight. Bro, if I can't handle Big Thunder, <laughs> I don't stand a chance against the rest. Goals for the future, maybe. <laughs> Help the others? I'm already helping where I can, bro. But I'm not a scientist. Floofty said if I touch their lab again, they'd give me an excoriating worthy of my fatuity. What? All right, just sit back then. Relax, huh? I guess it's been a while since I just chilled. I've been so busy fixing up Snacksburg, training, life coaching, and, you know, I've always got to take care of Snorpy. What the grump? Let's hang. We ought to shoot some hoops. All right, then. Sure, let's shoot hoops. All right. Time to shoot some hoops. Hoops, 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 hoops. Hoops, hoops, hoops. Yeah, hoops. You know the rules, dog. We're gonna take turns shooting hoops. First one to make five baskets wins. All right then. Go ahead and shoot your first shot. You got Yay. one point. My turn. <laughs> nice. Nice. One point. Let's go. That's two points. Can I get three pointer? Three pointer. My turn. Two nice. For me. Uh, it's too far, I think. Oh, they, yeah, I can't sh and throw that far. Yeet. Aw, oh, boo. Grump, I missed. He also missed. Three points. Three. Dog. Nice. Stop, my turn. I got three points. I, th I, th I, th uh -oh, I thought you were saying you got a three-pointer. <laughs> Yeet. Kobe. Whoa, five points. Yay. You won, dog. I didn't know you were such a baller. We got <laughs> a rematch sometime. Yay. They did it. Thanks for playing with me, bro. Now that we're done hanging, I got to get back to Snacksburg. I got to go check on Snorpy. Uh, we can't need that raft. I'll just make another raft. Or I'll swim back if I have to. The ocean's not that tough. Oh, bro. I'm gonna be real with you. This is the longest I've been away from Snorpy in years. And he's not okay without me. Aww. How about this? I'm gonna need some big energy for the trip back. You get me two of the biggest, strongest bug snacks on this island. And I'll stick around till I'm fueled up. Get a pillow bite and a celly sticks. All right then. And you, Norpy. Sorry, uh, your floofy. Sorry. You need a millimochi and a cheddar. Millimochi. Yum yum yum. Uh, hand in the cheddar, leg into millimochi. Just either one. All right then. Nice. And uh, hand is a cheddar. <clears throat> hand specifically. All right then. Intriguing. Hmm. All right then. Ah, decently competent work. Unfortunately, any remnants of the spice seem to have been digested, but this too yields interesting results. In their shrunken state, 
the bug snacks here are not fundamentally different from those on Snack Tooth proper. But they go so big. I am still forming my hypotheses, but I presume the process is endemic to this island, and the spice was created to inhibit it. The spice must flow because that's because the spice must flow. Any Nothing side effects? Beyond the usual. <laughs> After all, Chandler ate a bunga royale as soon as we arrived, and he seems alive and well. True. So this it be simple. will be simple. I am merely exhausting every avenue of study. It's called being thorough. Look it up. Now, All right, then. I've observed you say plants so. capable of maintaining a small size. This may present a more stable vessel for the spice. Regrettably, I must not eat it, delicious though it may be. So, bring one to my science trough, please. All right, then. I just dump it in? Yeah, I can just dump it in. I need to catch a uh, chocolate ant. Melimochi! I saw one chocolate ant, but, and, but I. But he kind of disappeared into the ground, so yeah. Ooh, look, it's a big one. Helo bite. It's necker. Interesting. There's plenty to investigate in this here ruin. All right, Stand then. Stand around and see what kind of clues you can find. All right, then. Leaders of the past. Destroyed door. Communal beds. Huge fire. <laughs> yep, a big, a big bonfire. Judging by what we've seen, I'd say this was a communal living space. One of the few that wasn't utterly destroyed anyway. And gosh. Technology and culture are so much more advanced than what we've seen so far. Whoa, technology. This must have been the center of Stone Grumpus society. And at the very center, the temple, possibly led by a priestess of Mother Nature. A priestess? What? Hmm, that's a great question. There's a rump definitely easier <laughs> ways to lock a door. <laughs> Seeing as this was the height of their craftsmanship, it's possible they built those mazes just to show off. Stop it. Tell me about Mother Nature. I don't know too much, but I'll say it's one of the world's oldest practicing religions. I'm sure Shelda could tell you more about it. All right, but then. on that subject, it's odd I never saw hide nor hair of Mother Nature back on Snacktooth. It's possible she showed up relatively late in their culture, adding to the existing worship of bug snacks. Let's explore the temple. Oh, I thought you'd never ask. <laughs> never look a gift temple in the gateway, as Grandma used to say. <laughs> sure. I'll meet you by the entrance, yeah? <laughs> All right, then. Let's catch this pillow bite. Ah, damn it. I guess we gotta light the bonfire. Let's use the... Yeah, use the bonfire. Oh, the door opened. And that opened the door. Ah, oh, cool. Oh, God. Oh, God, he's... Oh, God, he's... He's Morbin. He's Morbin. Get back here. He is Morbin. I low bite isn't. Oh, it's, it's Morbin time. Look out. There. He's naked. He's naked. All right. Now. Oh, and now he's frozen. Oh, now he's frozen. I, I guess now's the time to shrink him. Let's shrink him. There's some nice Rafflesia flowers here. 
He's frozen. Stop freezing him. I need him. Alright, he's shrunk. Now's, now's the time. Can, can we can just use this crap? Yeah, well, that works. Hi, little bite. Yay. So what did Chandler need? Pilobite and a celly sticks. Kadamsala. Oh god. Okay. It's big. Let's put the, the Kadamsala. Oh god, uh, no! There we go. Oh, it's cracked. What's that? Deviled Eggler. Egg, 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 eggler. Interesting. Hey, there's some Eggler shells right here. You wanna grab these Eggler shells? Just flies around the entire island. All right then. Let's take a look at the deviled eggler. So spaghider up there. I wonder. Let's use the lunch pad. Up onto up onto uh, the eggler, and put the. Ah, oh, damn it! Missed. <laughs> now let's wait for a new one. Damn it. There we go. Nice. Now we can use the trap, I think. I'm sure we'll be able to use the trap. Oh god! It's on fire! Why is it on fire? Oh, right, because it's it is on fire. <laughs> Why is it on fire? <laughs> yes. Why is it on fire? Oh yeah, because it's on fire. Oh, it does like hot sauce, right? Yeah, it likes hot sauce, so. Let's, let's shoot hot sauce at Millimochi. Oh god. Let's, let's use the Millimochi as, as bait. Oh, hi, Chad Orb. Let's use Millimochi as bait. This way. Hey, follow me. Follow me. Oh god. Eggler. Hey, Eggler. Yes, good. Perfect. Perfect. Deviled Eggler. Deviled Eggler. Uh, Spaghider. Hmm, I gotta figure out a way to get up to that Spaghider. I don't think, I feel like there's no way I can do that. I'll be able to do that right now. It's way, way too high up. Oh well. Let's move on for now. In here, a key. Strange triangular key. Key. This is in this triangular room. Illuminati confirmed. <gasps> Illuminati confirmed. 
Oh, hi. That's a Selly Sticks, all right. So big it only carries smaller bug snacks on its back. Giant Eggler Shell. Cheesy Glob. Is that? Interesting. I think that's just, uh, isn't that just, no. Wait, <laughs> I wonder. Are those bug snacks on its back? Are those like some extra bug snacks on its back? I don't know. There is a... There, there is some spice up there. Let's let, let's make the spice flow. Let, let us make the spice flow. Is there any way we can light? Is there uh, uh, any chain you know which, which we can light? We need we need a light. We need to light that those torches. Still nearby. Interesting. We need we need we need the, the trampoline. We need to we need the trampoline. What if we grab that that, that igler shell? Oh. Seems to like that igler shell. Seems to really like that eggler shell. Hmm. Hmm. Seems like this is as far as the, the grappler. Yeah, easy. Woo! Remind me to ask Snorpy for one of those grapplers. <laughs> Clubsteroni and a tikat and tikata masala. A Milimochi. Let's control more bounce, huh? Who likes hot sauce? Hey, come this way. I need you to, to grab this trampoline. Get some cheese. This way. Come this way. This way. Hold on, hold on. I didn't say you could leave yet. I need you. I need you here. Thank you. All right. Thank you. I used up so much sauce right there, but thank you. I really wish sauce ammo wasn't limited. Oh! Chocolant! It hates traps, apparently. Oh, he's mad. Chocolant, they're, they're Hershey's Kisses! They're made of- I like how they're, they're made of Hershey's Kisses. <laughs> All right, let's catch some chocolate. Oh, he disappeared. Go. Likes peanut butter. 
Lobsteroni. Interesting, they seem to despawn. Maybe we should Ivanite. But we should we There we go. There's a chocolant. Cool. Yay. Lobsteroni. I really. W I wonder how we can. Oh, I have an idea. I have an idea. We need. We need the trampoline. Actually, our inventory is full, so I should uh, empty it a bit. I should empty it before we continue. I should empty my inventory before we continue. Yeah. Let's do that. Let's go deposit this chocolate land. Uh, where's Chocolate? Chocolate? Chocolate. At last, a viable sample. Now I can extract the powder and finally put this mystery to rest. This requires my utmost concentration, and you ask far too many questions. You may return when I found my answer. Alrighty. Alright then. And I found on your food. Bye, Labite. <laughs> Oh, that counts apparently. Oh, cool, I guess. And a celly sticks. Yeah. Yeah. Yay! Oh, oof, oof. I think I ate Stinky. too much. So good though. No regrets. Oh. Oh, hey, while you were out there, I've been thinking. Before I go. I need some major guidance. What's that? Normally, there's stuff I can't talk about because Snorpy's always listening in. So, if not now, when? Uh, let's get you some guidance, I guess. All right, Shelda's waiting. Oh, Shelda. Hey, Sheldog, can I get some of your wisdom? Always, my child. I'm worried about Snorpy. Once more shall you be reminded. Snorpy is safer than we, Chandlo. Ease your burden. That's... that's not what I mean. I'm worried about the way he's been. All the paranoid stuff. The anxiety. I thought bringing Snorpy out here, out into nature, it might mellow him out. Flush all the bad vibes out of his system. But it's only gotten worse. I've known Snorpy all my life. But it feels like he's getting further away from me, and, and I just don't know what to do. Uh, one must in the path of the mother. No, uh, hold on. One does not want one's words to be misinterpreted when one says that boy needs therapy. <laughs> well, yeah, yeah, for sure. And I'm trying to do that. I make sure he's safe. I listen to his problems. I try to help him feel valid, all that stuff. Chandlo, you are strong and wise and wonderful, and you can do everything to support him. But you cannot fix him. Understand? Snorpy is lost in a maze of his own making, and it will take a professional to help him escape. That's a lot to take in. I need to think about it. Thanks for your wisdom, Shelda. 
You know, thank me when you actually take my advice. <laughs> hey, bro. While I'm still out here, I want to talk to Triffany and Floofty too. But there's still more I gotta know, you know? All right then. How's the analysis going? Blast it all! I do not need your distractions. I've obtained dried particles of plant slurry, but I have no way to analyze them. It's like living in the Stone Age out here. Perhaps if I had a particle separator, an electron microscope, and a degree in botany. Mm, bah! Plants are not my area of expertise. I, we do know an herbalist. You cannot be serious. I would sooner eat my bow tie than listen to a word of Shelda's advice. <laughs> Alright, eat your bow tie then. That was clearly a statement of <laughs> hyperbole. I very much like this bow tie, and I will not eat it even if doing so wins an argument. <laughs> but if Shelda can help. <laughs> if Shelda knows the secret of the shrink spice, I will eat my bow tie. Again? <laughs> well. Since you clearly won't start pestering me about this, let us go see Shelda. All right then. One senses the reek of a foul presence. Cease your hostilities, Shelda. I am here on business. I've been informed that you may possess a rudimentary understanding of phytochemical reactions, which I am in need of. <gasps> Strike the stars from the sky! The Wicked One has come to me for guidance. But surely one's ancient ways are far too primitive compared to the miracles of modern science. I do not appreciate your sarcasm. If you do not wish to help me, then simply say so and be gone with you. One would never. It is one's path to offer guidance to all who seek it, no matter how undeserving they may be. Very well. Then I require an analysis of the shrink spice. Tell me what is in it, and be quick about it. Please. Hmm, ah, yes. A poultice made in the herbological traditions of the mother. <laughs> Though its purpose I cannot condone. If that is what you desire, then one will enter the olfactory realm to find the answers you seek. Waft. Don't sniff. I know that. <laughs> Sniffs. <laughs> so many <laughs> subtle aromas. Witch hazel, cinnamon, uh, black tea. Each a natural remedy for inflammation. Inflammation, and among huh? These astringents. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't, don't sniff it too hard. Oil of vitriol. Oil of vitriol? That's sulfuric acid. A common but powerful desiccant. That certainly explains the burning sensation. Floofy, did you tell the journalist to throw acid at you? <laughs> well, this has been surprisingly not a waste of time. I am going to leave now. I may call on your services again. And you're welcome. So we did. We did. We did throw acid. So we threw. We threw acid at them. Good to know. Floofy, go talk to Chandler. Oh, I suppose it was only a matter of time. Tell Chanlo I will be with him shortly. Are we here to speak ill of my brother? I will gladly <laughs> go first. Complaint one of 294. No, no, that's nope. not why I asked you here. But I do want to talk about Snorpy. He wasn't like this when we were kids, right? I mean, he wasn't always so on edge, was he? Snorpington has always had his imagination and his moral compass, but no. I suppose he's gotten markedly more distraught since our project's dissolution. What happened between you two? I mean, I heard some of it from him, but I always wanted to hear your side too. And Snorpy doesn't really like me talking to you. Oh, I'm aware. I have a pile of threatening letters to that effect. However, I will gladly take this opportunity to set the record straight. We were working together on a government-funded research project. Advanced prosthetics that are ten times stronger than an ordinary grumpus. Interesting. But our dear Snorpington discovered that the government had less than savory plans for that technology. Of course. And despite my protestations, he tried to make those plans public knowledge. Understandable. Well, yeah, I don't blame him. 
Even you got to admit, that's pretty jacked up, dog. Am I the world's only optimist? That technology would have saved lives. If it must either exist with some consequences or not exist at all, I think the choice is clear. Easy to say when you aren't the one living with the consequences. Yeah, <laughs> where did you come from? <laughs> <sighs> Unfortunately, Snorpington agreed with you. He tried to play whistleblower, but before he could make a sound, we were both fired. And after that, there was a campaign to slander both of us, to discredit any allegations he might still make. So, well. there really was a conspiracy against you two? <laughs> if you must call it that. But only the most boring sort with paperwork and lawsuits. Still, that means it's not all in his head. Don't mistake justification for reason. Snorpicton has moved well beyond the realities of our situation. All right, Flifty. Thanks for telling me all that. Mm, happy to have enlightened you. Honestly, I expected this conversation to involve more shouting and headlocks. <laughs> no, not this time. We're cool. But hey, we should talk more often. And maybe I can show you how to headlock me. Perhaps. But for now, my work beckons. All right, then. Uh, you know what? Real quick, I'm gonna return to the island, and I'm and I'm gonna donate some of this, uh, some of these snacks, and clear up some of my inventory. Deviled Eggler, sure. Flutter Jam. Milimochi. All right, who wants some cake? Let's feed. Yeah, let's feed everyone some cake. Have some cake. Have cake. Have some cake. Have some. Have some cake. Everyone gets cake because I need. I need to get rid of it. <laughs> Yay! All of you get cake. Oh, oh, everyone's back. <laughs> hey, how's it going? Have some cake. Ooh. <laughs> okay. Huh? Producing that your loves cold but isn't frosty. Cheery. Okay. Hey, buddy. Insta bug. Like totes. Insta bug. Okay. I have some cake. Day. Hey, buddy. Where I find Instabug again? All oh, right, I remember. You know what? Real quick, let me go grab an Instabug. Why not? Since I know a way to get one. the bug I know it hides in one it's it, it hides in one of these bushes I remember that no, no. up there I see I see you Insta bug. Go feed, feed. Back again, Insta bug. Hello, Tiffany. Hey, nice to see you. Insta bug. Insta bug. Ah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. Yay. Oh yeah. Huh? 
So in all four are legendary snacks. All right then. Let, but let's let's go back to to Broken Tooth for now, and let's continue. Let's keep keep, keep on keeping on. Uh, Shalda, what do you got? What have you got? Ooh, thanks for meeting me out here. I guess if it's just you and me, <laughs> I can keep it casual. All right, then. Oh, the front entrance to this place looks too strenuous for these old bones. But I believe there's a side entrance into the shrine. When you find it, can you please open it for me? Roger. I have an idea on how to get it. We're gonna need more sauce. First, we're gonna need more sauce. <clears throat> we need to lure this guy, this Clobsteroni. Boing. Boing, boing. No. God damn it. Not what I meant. Hey. <clears throat> this place. It's almost identical to the shrines I used to visit in my youth. But it's been twisted. Corrupted. Here, Mother Nature is the bringer of bug snacks. The stories they passed down... The warnings about the toxin. They must have come from experience. Story shrines for you? Yes, the place where I learned about the beauty and wisdom of this world. I hear it's a parking lot now. <laughs> <gasps> no. Like the that song? mother is a purest light. Her ageless wisdom vastly predates these vile monstrosities. But... Her followers are a different story. No one starts life on the path. That's why we all need guidance. What stories? I grew up hearing stories about the dangers of Snacktooth Island. Passed down through the oral tradition from those who survived it. Mm. Not that many did survive it. Just enough to give one very clear message. The toxin must not be consumed. Okay. Why not consume the toxin? Because it will lead to your doom. What doom? I I do not know. The story's gotten frustratingly <clears throat> vague over time. As it always does. Why'd you tell us? I did! Every day at the top of my lungs! It's all of you who didn't listen. Why'd you come here? It wasn't really a raffle, I can tell you that. <sighs> come with me to the crater. There's something else I want to see. Greater? Oh, this crater. Oh, it's a short there's a shortcut. Here, how do we open the temple? Oh, hey! You can see the cave <clears throat> from up here. At a nice, safe distance. Anywho, there should be a mechanism here that'll get us through that door. Might be a bit of a jog, though. I see. Whoa! Oh, it launches me all the way back to the camp. How nice.
What are you looking for? Uh, hold Don't on. Let the bug snacks bite. What are you looking for? Yes, this is the place. In the stories, they call this island Broken Two. So the story goes, the toxin's influence grew so great and powerful that the sun itself went dark. And so Mother <clears throat> Nature unleashed her wrath on her errant followers, purging <clears throat> the toxin and sending everything to the depths of the ocean. The creator is, mo is the mother's wrath? Looks a lot like wrath to me. <laughs> But that story never sat right with me. Destroying followers who stray? That isn't the mother I know. She's not the bringer of bug snacks either. The ancients can't even get their story straight. So what am I supposed to believe? Hmm. If I can't rely on the wisdom of those past, then all that's left is my own experience. I need to meditate. Child, if you would do me a kindness. You see that egg, Lachelle? I need you to crack open three of them. This time, it's not a metaphor. All right, then. I need to find two more giant egg, Lachelle's. I see. I know where one is. But then there's still one more I need to look out for. Oh, I got chocolate. Ant. It's too far. Damn it. <laughs> hmm. Interesting. You're on fire. Oh, wait. Yeah. No, of course you're on fire. You're literally in the fire. You're the anyways. Very no worky. Temple's open. Oh god, I didn't mean to fall. Damn it. God damn it. Find an English shell. There's one. A range, really? No, bring that back here. I need that. There we go. That works. Another de doubled eggler? That's two. Hates doubled eggler. Hates Eggabel? So it hates eggs. <laughs> Loves hot sauce. Hates the Eggler. Hates deviled Eggler. Hates Eggabel. Sky! It just hates eggs in general. It hates Eggler, it hates Devil Egg Eggler, and it hates Eggabel. Why? Because her name has egg in it? <laughs> <clears throat> We are on the island of big. We are hello, Sky. We are on the island of big bug snacks. 
Chan Lo. I'm happy to chat with Chan Lo. Let's meet by the campfire. Okay. What's going on, Chan Lo? Trippany, you know about history and like ancient societies and stuff. Shelda said Snorpy's lost in a maze of delusion. But what if it's not a delusion? What if there really is a Grumpinati? Well, I've done some research on my own, and uh, near as I can tell, there's no such thing. At least not in the way you see in the movies. There's no shadowy cabal secretly in control of the world. Are you sure? Real conspiracies can't happen. And heck, there was an old literary society called the Grumpinati, but aside from the name, it's not at all what <laughs> Snorpy talks about. Are you sure? I mean, I've seen Snorpy's charts, and they kind of make sense. Kinda is the important word here, though. Look, there are points of data on that chart that are real, but it's all those strings between them that are made. Oh, that's America. <laughs> no, those are real. We got them from Gramble. Oh, Chandlo, that's not, uh, what I... Up, 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 let it go, my child. Point is, Snorpy might be a talented engineer, but he's no historian, and he's certainly not immune to bias, you know? Yeah, I guess you're right. I hope you're right. Thanks for talking to me, Triff Dog. No problem. And if you ever want to know more about failed conspiracies throughout history, you know where to find me. All right. Yay. You done? What do you gotta do now? Bro, I feel like there's a huge weight on top of me. And Bro. it's not the kind I can lift. Snorpy never would have come to Snack Tooth if I didn't push him into it. All I do now is make him exercise and ignore all the stuff I don't understand. Shelda's right. I don't know enough to really help him. And thinking I do is only making it worse. I'm gonna stay here. Until everybody's ready anyway. I need some time to just think. All right. We. All right then. So this. Run. All right. Cool. Oh. Way to go! That was some fancy footwork. Oh wow. Okay. This time the ancient architects were definitely showing up. Yeah, that's. But you know, a lot of maze. This ludicrously complex maze tells me that whatever's in the temple beyond is just that important. So you know the drill. Let's get to solving. <laughs> yeah, this is a ludicrously complex maze. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Time to solve this ridiculously complex maze. This isn't see this honestly doesn't seem that complex, but it's just I mean it's it not not complex ex not not that complex in the sense that it's not it's pretty straightforward, but it's, it's uh, it was like it's and it's really unnecessary how complex this is. Oh no, we gotta watch out for the chocolate. All right, we should be good. Watch out for the chocolate, which is apparently which seems to be made of Hershey's Kisses. All right, cool. We got past the chocolate land. All right, I guess we need to time this. All 
We need to get on the right one. Maybe this one? Go. Go, 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 go. Nice. I don't think this is the right one. Nah. Keep running backwards. Aw, it's fine. All right, wait for the next one. What a delightful chocolate end, yes. Go, nice. All right, now what? Oh, we're at the top now. Okay, I see. No, ah. Need to stay up here for now. Wait and wait for it or hit the platform and we're up. We're through. Nice. Yay! Good job. You know, it took all my willpower not to just jump in and do it myself. I mean that'd be fine if you Anywho, did it yourself. Open, <laughs> but whatever. So let's get going. <laughs> Yay. Thank you, Sprout. Hmm. What have we got here? Well, that's a kick in the teeth. So much for seeing the temple. It's Jumped kind of collapsed. <laughs> this collapse must have happened when folks were still living here. Maybe the crater is connected somehow. Come to think of it, we didn't find a single corpse back in the commune. Where'd all those grumpuses get to? Well then, I'm not about to let this mystery go unsolved. I've just got to roll up my sleeves and clear this rubble myself. Can we ask the others? Oh, no. No, we don't need to trouble everybody with all this. I know my way around ruins. I'll be just fine on my own. You sure? You just leave this to me. Go on about your day, and I'll have it done in a jiff, okay? All right, then. Good luck. All right, I guess we got to wait a whole day. For her to be done. Oh, let's go uh, do some other stuff oh, oh, while we're waiting. Let's do some parkour. What's up here? Ah! Hmm. Why are these so perfectly laid out for, for us to climb, I wonder? I'm still not exactly sure how we're supposed to catch a spaghider. Well, I have an idea. I have an idea how we can and, and do such a thing. Big spooter made of spaghetti. Yes, big spooter made of spaghetti. I have an idea. I have an idea. It requ requires me. It requires me to lure. To, to to lure or uh, lobsteroni, it loves hot sauce. Let's go use our hot sauce. Let's go lure it. Wait until it gets a bit closer to up, to min, so we can min max. <laughs> Using up a lot of hot sauce. I think that should be far enough. Yeah, that should be good enough, I think. Yeah, using up a lot of hot sauce right there. Oh, and you can both pick up the trampoline. Oh, no, I missed. I missed the trampoline. Now you're holding that trampoline. Uh... This thing's not gonna last long enough. I'm thinking we could we can jump on the trampoline and then and while we're in the air throw it. Throw the throw the thing. Just wait for a new one. Let's just wait for a new one. Come on. Hello. 
Oh, he's taking on a new path. Make up your mind what path you want to take, jeez. Eh. Not quite. <laughs> oh, what's up? What's going on here? It's like, he can't decide on what path he wants to take. Oh, well, apparently that shrank the, the celly sticks. Maybe it's because of the celly sticks that he got stuck. No. I, I don't... He can't decide... He can't seem to decide what path he wants to take. Like, he keeps changing between these two paths. And I'm not sure why. He keeps changing between these two paths. He's, I think he's broken. I think he might be broken. I wonder. I'm gonna try something. Can we uh, do this? Oh. No! Not my trap. You took my trap. How dare you. Not my trap, my, uh, my trip shot. Didn't quite work. Oh, I wonder if I can just- if he's got- I wonder if he will oh, grab the shrink powder. I wonder if it will grab the shrink powder. Seems to like grabbing things. So, hold this for me. Hey, hold this for me. Hold this. I said hold this. It, do it doesn't seem to like- Uh, oh! Um. Interesting. <laughs> ah, you know why? Did, I don't know why I didn't think of that before. I can just, I can just use a launch pad, a lunch pad. I mean. Uh, okay, so I just drop this here. Use a, a launch pad. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, no, what, are you serious, bruh, that works, he's still tiny though, I mean, okay, well, that worked, I guess, um, that's fine, I guess, can you stop? Can you not? Can you not? Please. There. We got the spooter. We have got- we have acquired the spooter. Now let's go look for this last eggshell. Now we gotta look for one more eggshell. Maybe it's behind this. It's behind this temple door. I still have no idea how to catch this guy though. Doesn't seem quite. Make him fall in the water. I don't have anything I can do that. Alright, uh... Will somebody set me on fire? Eh? Aww. Well, let's see what's over here. Let's see what's over here, I guess. Boing! This way. Not that way. This way. Oh. 
Yeah, I tried. Do we need to use the chocolate? Yeah. Oh, thank you. Thank you, chocolate. Oh, there's the egg. There's the last egg, and there's the torch. Chocolant. Oh, the egg's on fire. The egg is on fire. I guess we're having. I guess we're having boiled egg. Now, nope, time to bring this egg all egg all the way over to the crater. Follow me, egg. Follow me. It's fine, we can have boiled egg. Can crack the egg. That's a third deviled eggler. So now what? Crack the eggler oh, shells. Thank you. I know that wasn't an easy task. Ah, bug snacks are so often in the shape of unliving things, but somehow these shells are just shells. <laughs> They're also the only good source of calcium on this island. <laughs> Don't judge me. I'm fighting osteoporosis. <laughs> Understandable, <gasps> I guess. <laughs> anyway, I've centered my thoughts. I want to know for myself what bug snacks are. Whether they're of the mother or not, I'm going to need that big old nasty flying bug snap. Please, bring it to the box of purity when you get the chance. <laughs> All right, then. It hates... hates deviled eggler. Oh, hi. Uh, hi, hi, Chet Orb. So I guess we got lure. I need hot sauce. I need more hot sauce. Got, I guess we got lure. Got lure the deviled eggler over. Over to. Over to it. I'm gonna need again. Again, I'm gonna need more hot sauce. Conveniently, they give lots of hot sauce. Let's open this door and oh, and there's some more uh, spice. Spice must flow. There's more spice, so we can uh, so we can let it flow. Guy flies around the entire island, which is kind of annoying. This guy literally flies around the entire island. So I gotta pick a very specific time and hope it works. And now oh, I got. Doesn't seem to be responding to my hot sauce. No, oh, there we go. There, there's the hot sauce. I wonder. Maybe we could. We could cover the the Takata masala. Oh, um, everything is on fire. Everything is on fire right there. It's fine. Run. Go, 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 go. 
Why must we run so slow? Where where is the tikka masala? God damn it! Let's give it some hot sauce. I wonder if that's enough. That that might possibly lure lure a, a deviled eggler in uh, towards it. Well, actually, let's try uh, let's try shrinking it first. Though it's still on fire, we need some way to extinguish it. Get in front of it. Use the lunch pad. What? What happened? What happened? Well, it's shrunk, but we still need to extinguish it. Now it's tiny, yeah. Oh, hi. Let's see if we can and cover both of them in hot sauce. Oh! Um. That didn't quite work. Okay, uh, we need... The Millie Mochi. Let's okay, new new plan. No, it, no, not chocolate. Oh god, hi. Oh hello. Hi. Oh. This way. Oh, he's still big. Why is he still? He's big. He's big again. Ah, oh, god damn it. Uh, I'm, I am causing so much chaos. Nope. Oh, and he's frozen now. I did it! The, the entire island is in chaos, but we're, <laughs> this entire island is in chaos, but worth it's worth it. <laughs> we did it. Did we have we caught everything? Everything but one, which is probably the boss. But yeah, we caught everything except that except one, which is probably like the boss, the boss bug snack. So yeah. Uh, here, have this. Got a masala. Thank you. I swear I'm not going to eat it this time. Are you sure? Nay, for I seek the very essence of bug snacks. That spirit which drives them to create their poisonous delights. Unfortunately, I have no grumpin' clue how to do that. You, should, you could ask Floofty. <gasps> Floofty? Are you out of your grumping mind? One would never consult with that... Wicked alchemist. You want to learn? Yes, one wants to learn. Not to receive long-winded insults. I guess. But, one must admit, when it comes to delving into the Forbidden, there is none more bold than Floofty. Oh, well, if that is how it must be, then may the mother protect me. 
All right. Ah, Zelda, you seem to be dangerously close to my personal space. If you're here to trap me in a spell circle again, I will inform you that I could leave at any time and I was merely acting. Temper your contemptuous heart. One is here on a quest for understanding to unlock the forbidden knowledge of bug snacks. Oh, and you've come to me. Why don't you ask your mother naturally? Or Crystal, or whatever you talk to. The pact is shrouded at the moment. One believes that clearing this impasse requires a more scientific lens. How interesting. Are you certain? I'm given to understand that I exude a fetid aura of utter evil from every pore. You are reckless and arrogant and so, so rude. But one does not truly believe that you are evil. <laughs> well, I have little time nor patience for your games. If you want to know something, stop speaking like a horoscope and ask. Ugh. I want to know the essence of bug snacks. What is it they're made of? If I can understand that, then I might know whether they're actually separate from Mother Nature or born from the darkness of her history. I'm not about to resolve your philosophical quandaries. There is no answer to the why of the universe. Bug snacks simply exist. However, since you've finally taken an interest in my studies, then just this once I will educate you. I can show you how to extract live snack matter for microscopic viewing without that matter denaturing. Ah, but if I were to explain it to a very small infant, denaturing is... I know what denaturing means. <laughs> you do? I'm here to learn about bug snacks, not vocabulary. Ah, very well then. Our lesson should proceed smoothly. All right, have fun with that. one of 17, <laughs> preparing an adequate formula and solution. Thank you for encouraging this old lady to learn something new. Now you better leave us to it. I sense this may take a while. Yeah, probably. Signed, yeah, kind of. All right then. Apparently my 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 uh, lunch pad is still there. Let's get that back. <laughs> and let's check on Triffany. How how's she doing? It's been a day. How are you doing? Looks like you've made no progress. Any luck with the rubble? Oh, it's not going too good. I'm starting to worry I might never see the inside of this temple. Hey, Flufty. Knowing them, they'd go and whip up some chemical that dissolves rocks and only takes three-fourths of their blood to make. It's safer for them if I don't ask. I mean, I guess. <laughs> Zelda? Ah, could be. But I don't know that I need even more riddles to solve. Besides, I've heard the sounds her back makes. She could really <laughs> use a lie-down. Chanlo? I don't know. Maybe he could. But if I put him in any danger, Snorpy's gonna hear about it. And then I'll hear about it every day for the rest of my life. It could all work together. Oh, I was afraid you'd say that. Teamwork. Sure, teamwork would really help out here. But those grumps can't go more than an hour without starting a big fight. And I, uh, I just freeze up. You know, I'm an expert in my field and all. But I'm not a management type. It's better if I just concentrate on my work and let them cool off on their own. Don't we don't think it incorporates? Honest, no, I don't. These kind of spats, they just fester and grow. And before you know it, civilization collapses. Look, some folks just don't get along. Some mysteries just go unsolved. There's nothing I can really do about it. But at least we gave it a shot. I'll see you back at camp. Oh, well, okay. I guess we're just done. <laughs> yep, I've helped everyone investigate. I guess we're just done here. Now what? Let's get back to the camp. No 
no, 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 I guess I could also use that, that Milimochi eat it to extinguish the Kata Masala. That's fine. Let me grab some more sauce. <clears throat> let's, head, let's head back to the camp and see if we're done. Because we've, we've done every we've done everyone's quest. But yeah, let's talk to Griffin. We've all been investigating. Oh, that's nice. Well, if that's the case, then I'm gonna go gather everybody up so we can share what we all learned. This might be a long meeting, so let me know if you've still got some business to do. Now let's get started. Fantastic. All right, everybody. Team meeting. Team meeting. Thanks for meeting everybody. It seems like we've all had an interesting time so far, ya? Yeah? Indeed. I must say, I'm eager to see what grisly curiosities you found in your studies, Professor. Oh, uh, I better not go first. I'm sure I'll just ramble on all night. Say, Chandlo, did you ever find a way to get bigger? Not physically, nah. But I did grow in, like, a metaphorical way. Sorry I couldn't help more with the science. Do not apologize, child. Knowing oneself is the most valuable kind of knowing. I mean, she does have a point. And, <laughs> Shilda, what did you find out about Mother Nature A? With some <clears throat> additional insight, one has learned that bug snacks are indeed children of the mother, yet toxins still. Just as every fang dripping with venom, every flower glistening with poisonous sap. <laughs> a reminder that nature can be very unkind. Grump, yeah? Nature's hardcore! Ah, uh, like some. The ancients may have worshipped the mother, but her light was lost on them. The tooth remains broken, and one believes that this was not the work of the divine. The truth of its destruction and rebirth remains shrouded. That is so interesting. Oh, I swear, we've got to talk about history soon, Shelda. But first, let us discuss my findings. With some <clears throat> minor assistance, I was able to reproduce the newly discovered shrink spice. After some experimenting, I've learned that these big bug snacks are actually small by default. Something about the snack matter on this island causes them to enlarge. I believe I understand the how, but I've yet to discover the why. There is no why, Flutie. Things simply are. Using my words <laughs> against me. Invent your own wisdom, you sagacious charlatan. I would, if you ever listened to anybody but yourself. Oh, Please, let's not start. <laughs> <laughs> that happening now? <laughs> oh, you missed it, Drift Dog. Floofty and Shelda teamed up to brain slam this mystery. They... they have? Shocking, I know. The things I do for science. Yes, the path is ever winding. But one apologizes for the distraction as it is time to feast on the fruits of the historian's knowledge. Oh, well, hmm, I, I've certainly learned a lot, but there are still plenty of mysteries abound, and I think it's possible we'll find all the answers inside the temple. Unfortunately, there's a bit of a collapsed hallway there, and I've got no way to get through. I believe we may have a solution for that. My combined research with Shelda has produced something quite useful indeed. Oh, yeah! Floofty asked me to build Don't a- Don't ruin the surprise. Trust me, it will be very entertaining. Is it- is it a bomb? Your ominous sentence has never been uttered. Well, that all sounds good to me. Let's head to the temple. Did you build a bomb? Well, there it is. Think you can do something about this debris? No problem, Drift Dog. Floofty, let's get the thing ready. Of course, the thing. You, place your buggy ball on the ground in front of us. 
All right. Good. Now turn around. And no peeking. <clears throat> we wouldn't want to ruin the surprise, would we? Right. No peeking. I've got it out of How am I everyone else gets to look? Slippery little thing. Keep it still or the needle will Ow! What the grub is that stuff? You'll live. There we go. And Oh. He's... Whoa! Don't let go! Strav. He's big, isn't he? Oh no, you don't! Strav. We made him big, isn't didn't we? Gotcha! You may now turn around. All right, bro. Feast your eyes on the new and improved big. Table. He's big. Uh, I wanted to call it the engorged Straviform or bacula encasement. But we can't always get what we want. Big. With this much snack power, we can tear down that wall. Go. That's that easy. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> Problem solved. You are all very welcome. Oh, we did yeah. it. Big Stravi. Send to yep. yourself. <laughs> and yep, he's off. <laughs> this is not a creation to be celebrated. But to be feared. Yeah, but we did do pretty good, huh? <laughs> Ooh, I could ask a million questions about how that works. But first things first, let's poke around in these ruins. All right, then. Let's go. There he, there he is. All right, you stay here. And for clues. Horn statue. Temple mural. Sealed well. Temple mural. <laughs> um, Grandpa's being sacrificed to, to a great maw. Mm, yes, sacrifice. Mother or naturally. Alright then. This is a bad place. That's an understatement. <laughs> I told you that the stone grumps. That this is a sacrificial chamber. Yeah? Well, this was the place. They throw grumpuses down that pit, offering them up to whatever's down there. Hmm. Is that why the bug snacks here get so big? Because the soil's been uniquely fertilized? Fertilized by the dead people? By the sacrifices? What's going on? I found this machine thing buried here. Kinda reminds me of Snorpy's lunch pads. Indeed. Yet large enough to launch something of significant size. In fact, it seems to be perfectly suited for the big buggy ball. I believe an experiment <clears throat> is in order. Alright. This way. Whoa! Sprout got locked in there! Uh, now what? Now we launch. There seems to be a triggering mechanism on the back. It may require a jolt from the snack rattler to activate. Yes, now. Fire! Fire! Yay, hey, we did it! Oh, that can't be a good sign. What did you all do? Is emanating from the sealed pit. Ready yourselves. A grave danger approaches. Bros, I get the feeling I'm about to get dunked on again. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa! That is a big <laughs> cheddar abortal <laughs> Rex. <laughs> Rolls uh, ch cheddar orbs. Uh, oh, cheddar orbs. Cheddar abortal uh, uh, Rex. Oh jeez, he's throwing things at me. Catch I need to catch him, everyone is dead. I wonder. Oh I I see, I see. I I see. Ah 
I see. I see what we have to do. Where is, uh... Where's Sprout? Sprout is gone. We need these chat- we need to use the chat orbs. Ow. We gotta use the chat orbs, I guess. How do we lure the chat orbs? That's it. Yeah. Launch! Yes! That's how we do it. So that's how we do it. Gotcha. I like how it auto aims. I like how it auto aims. It, 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 it seems to really not like those catapults. This tiny hole. Where's Sprout? We, we it, it threw Sprout somewhere. <laughs> it, it, oh god, he's throwing rocks now. I need, I need you to throw rocks. No, we need, we need to actually throw the rocks, I think. He's throwing rocks. Out the way, Chet Orb. Come on, throw the rocks at me. It's not quite working. Oh, I I know. I know. I need to use the, the chat orbs. Oh! That works, I guess. I know... I believe he... he when this when this DLC first came out, uh, you could... You can, I believe you could actually soft lock the game if you if you tried to use Sprout. If you tried to use the buggy ball, you could soft lock the game. Which is why they they stopped you from actually doing that. Which is why during now during this fight they disabled the, the buggy ball. There we go. He's very cracked. He's smashing all the catapults. What's left? Oh, a big catapult. It's a big one. Oh, so close. That's a big catapult. Come on, throw it at me. Oh, he blocked it. He blocked. He blocked it. The cheddar. Yeah, you kind of a cheddar orb stuck to you. Need to make sure he's not, uh... Need to make sure he's not throwing rocks. First, the rocks will block, will block it, I think. There we go. Oh, God. Oh, he smashed the catapult. He keeps smashing the catapults. There's another one. There's another one over here. Meanwhile, everyone is still dead. 
rocks. Ow. 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 It's fine. Ow. It's fine. I'm fine. It's just giant rocks. No big deal. Watch out for the next rock attack. Yep. There's just a few rocks. It's fine. Ah! Oh! It hit! That was a hit. Nice. I'm stuck. Oh, there's more. Oh, it's, uh... Oh, there's Sprout! There he is! He's back! This way! No, don't throw Sprout again! Actually, wait. We do need to throw Sprout again. That's a rock. Ow. Yep, just throw him at me. Get in. Yeah, now we have a giant maze. Eh. Go, Sprout! Follow- just- don't worry about me, just follow the- just follow the laser. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. It's just the- it's just some rocks. I'm gonna have a- a, bi a big concussion- I'm just gonna have a big concussion once- once we're done. It's fine, don't worry about it. Activate it. What does that do? Oh, that logic isn't met him. He's broke, he's cracked. He's, he's cracked, well now he's cracked. Now we should be able to, to use this. Now he's tiny. And now he's tiny. Ah, uh, still not quite. Should be able to use it as a trip shot, though. Yeah. We got the ch Cheddar Bordel Rex. We did it. Good job, Sprout. We did it. Bro, I better eat that thing before it bulks up again. It'll be fine. Here, eat it. Eat it. Now your body is made of cheese. Yeah! I don't know if it's the adrenaline talking, but that's the best bug snack I've ever had! Alright, let's check if everybody's okay. Now your whole body is made of cheese. Phew! Good to see we're all in one piece. Everyone's alive! The biggest snack I've ever seen. Nothing like a giant monster fight to get the blood pumping! <laughs> Speak for yourself. One is far too old for this. <laughs> Agreed. But now that the danger is past, I'd like to revisit what precisely all of this means. You know, judging by the temple roof, the collapses, the crater, I mean, it's just a thought. But I think ages ago something big came out of that pit. Well, yeah. We just saw the cheddar portal come out of there. <laughs> If the Cheddar Bottle could be handled by one mediocre journalist, I doubt it could destroy an entire civilization. Yeah, I'm thinking much bigger and much nastier. Something we can hardly even imagine. The wrath of Mother Nature, or perhaps the wrath of those sacrificed. Amusing as this grisly history is, none of that explains why the island suddenly rose from the sea. Maybe it wanted to be found. Uh, islands don't generally want things, Champlo. Aww. Unless those lost and vengeful lie dormant still beneath our feet. You know, I think I've learned all I can for now. What say we call it quits today? For our own good. <laughs> all right. All right. Okay. Good <laughs> okay. Okay. So, do you want to come back to the raft with us or keep exploring? Uh, let's go back to the raft. Wonderful. And on the way, I'll regale you with stories about other temple collapses. Because I think we're done here. Yay. Oh, okay. 
We're done with this island. Yay. Achievement, deep impact. Snort dog! Chandler, my l <coughs> um, <coughs> You're, You're what? Teeth. <laughs> and I mean, of course you are. I had the utmost faith in you. Oh, please. You were likely in tears the entire time. I was. He's your love and you know it, uh, indeed. Tiffany, <laughs> what in the world did you find out there? Oh, gosh. That's a long story. I kind of want to get home to Wamby first, if you don't mind. But uh, let's meet up in town and I'll tell you the details over some snack waters, yeah? Yes, let's. You made cheese ah, now, yes. Shelter's alive and well. Yeah, my joints are killing me. <laughs> but sure. I, uh, uh, one must meditate with a tincture of willow and cloves. Uh, if you inform me of the recipe, I could find a way to augment the effects. Consider this an effort to be less deliberately antagonistic towards you. Uh, thanks, I guess. Foofties <laughs> being helpful? Seriously, Chandler, what happened over there? Grumpinati mind control? Things happened. Know. We're just finding ourselves out here, Snorp Dog. And, uh, speaking of that, Snorpy, I'm sorry for making you come to Snack Tooth. Oh, well, well that's all right. It may not be my favorite place, but, but I know you're just doing what you think is best. Yeah, that's the problem. Well, you sound like you've got something weighing on your mind. Yeah, I do. But I think it can wait. Let's just go home and chill, okay? Ah, ah well, well, I'm nothing if not chill. Thanks for everything, <laughs> dog. We'll see you back at Snacksburg. Okay. No, oh, that's now that quest line is resolved. I think we've pretty much done all of the side quests in this game. Yay! I think we've completed. Uh, I think with that, I think that's all the side quests in this game completed. Yay! Look at time. Uh, six thirty. I am. I'm not sure if we should, if, if we should like try to finish the game now because I'm not sure how long it will take. I feel like it's gonna take around an hour or so, which I don't know if I want to spend and do, do another hour now. I mean, maybe I could do it another one tomorrow, a short stream, because I I do want to finish this game this week. <clears throat> I do want to finish the game this week. Because on on Thursday I'm gonna be, I'm I'm gonna be uh, g going, I'm gonna be going back home on 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 Thursday, so yeah. I'm gonna be flying all the way back home on Thursday. I'm going home. Yes. It's been it 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 it, 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 ha it has been literal years. But yeah, I <clears throat> I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna end this end the stream. I think yeah, I think I'm gonna end the stream now, and then I'll just probably maybe do a short stream tomorrow to finish this. So yeah, anyways, I'm gonna end the stream now. Thank you guys for coming coming hey, over, and I'm I'll go now. What's up? Yep. Bye stream.